Welcome back. We're following breaking news right now out of Ann Arbor. Our eye in the sky chopper, as you can see, live over a house explosion. You can see all of that smoke billowing. This is unfolding on South 7th Street at a home there. We're told there are injuries, but we don't know how many people have been hurt or the extent of their injuries. Jordan Burroughs is there live in Ann Arbor right now. Jordan, what can you tell us? Uh, so behind me, as you can see, home explosion here uh, in Ann Arbor off of South 7th Street. Uh, something important to keep an eye on today is we know that one person was inside this house at the time of the uh, home explosion just a couple of hours ago. That person was taken to the hospital with just minor injuries. Uh, if you're looking at this house fire right now, too, as we got on scene just a little while ago, uh, the fire has since dissipated mostly, but a lot of just this plume of smoke remains. And you can see a lot of fire engines and firefighters here are doing what they can to make sure that a fire doesn't reignite or that rubble doesn't reignite as well. This is about one mile away from uh, the big house, about one mile away from downtown Ann Arbor. We know about four to five fire trucks here right now working um, as hard as they can to get this fire out here on South 7th Street. Uh, something important to keep in mind too is uh, they've got all these hoses lined up in this back of this truck too, so it makes us think that uh, possibly they have run out of water for now. It looks like they might need to go refill uh, their portion as well. Uh, there's onlookers here too. Community members have been walking up and seeing what's going on here with this house explosion. Uh, but all in all, just one person taken to the hospital with injuries. Another home uh, next to this house with the house explosion uh, was affected by the fire. We know the Ann Arbor Fire Department was here. They responded quickly and they're doing their best to make sure everything is okay. And the fire marshal's office, they are the ones who will be investigating because at this time they are not sure the cause of the fire. Reporting live in Ann Arbor, I'm Jordan Burroughs, CBS News, Detroit.